And the first question that I have here, it's uh, how to set up folders in the browser. So this is a, a good question. It took me um, a, a couple of uh, tutorials or uh, in the beginning, I, I was only using the, the, um, the sounds that were inside of FL Studio. And I was just dragging and dropping from my folder uh, the sounds that I wanted. And uh, it took me a while to use this uh, feature, this tool, or this functionality of FL Studio to have, have this um, setup. So I'm going to show you how to do that. And it's very helpful so that you can have all of your sounds and all of your libraries and all of your VSTs, everything included. Uh, maybe not VSTs because you can have your VSTs in a different way, but uh, all of your sounds and um, you can have them in FL Studio so that you can just drag and drop and, and browse through your folders, or browse to your files. And it's a, a, a better way. I think it's something that um, I see in some other DAWs and I see some other people using a different way, which I, I would not enjoy too much. I would like to, to just stay inside of... Um, um, uh, I, I see also uh, no one from no one Alves from 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 uh, from Brazil and uh, hi hi guys um, okay so uh, <laughs> this cuts my my thought process but uh, it's fine so let's go ahead and move to FL Studio and um, and show how you can set up the um, the folders so here we have FL Studio. And uh, the first thing that you have to do is open up the folder and see the browser actually, and see if you have all of your files here. And if you don't, which it's usually uh, not set up by default, the thing that you have to do is you have to go to your options. And then there's a couple of options here in the, in the system. And um, you have MIDI, audio, general, and file settings. If we click on file settings, you see that I already have a bunch of folders here set up and you can see, for instance, music business. And if I go here, there's music business and music production, music production, all, all these files, folders here, actually, that you can just set up a, a, a folder here and it will show automatically here in the browser. So it's very simple, very easy to do. You just click on a folder and you select whatever folder you want. We can create a new folder here in the desktop and call this test folder for the browser, browser like that. And we can just hit OK and the folder will show here and automatically shows there. As you can see, the when I added the folder here, it automatically showed there. So that's it. If you want to change the name, let's say that you have a generic folder here and you want to change the name of the folder, you just go here to this section and you type um, name, let's put name of the folder and you hit enter and then you have to go and refresh your settings or reread structure. And as you can see now, where is it? Folder, name of my folder and this is the folder that we just added. So the name of the folder is actually test folder for the browser. And uh, then you named the folder, name of the folder. So whatever name you put here, it will be the name that it shows here. And um, I don't think you have to be very careful about this. You can put whatever name and whatever uh, stuff that you want. The only thing is that sometimes you can uh, search for the folder here, name of the folder, and that folder does not exist. The actual name is test folder for the browser. So if you want, you have to go back here and check exactly what is the name of the folder so that you can uh, pretty much uh, search for the folder in your system.